23 years ago today, a Towson University student was shot and killed in Baltimore County. Jody LaCornu's twin sister has never given up the frantic search to find who pulled the trigger. Devin Bartolotta shows us three new reasons the family hopes answers could come soon. On display above three of Baltimore's busy thoroughfares. Billboards beg for answers. It's hard. I mean, I, I, you know, I struggle. I struggle a lot. Saturday marks 23 years since Jenny Carrieri's sister, Jody LaCornu, was shot and killed on York Road in Baltimore County. Jenny has made it her life's mission to find her murderer. The day that we buried her, it was rainy and cold, and um, so it's kind of brought me back to that. Um, yesterday, I was thinking a lot about her and um, just feeling really sad and, and frustrated. Jody was shot in the back while in her car in the Drumcastle Shopping Center, then drove across the street to York Road Plaza, where she died. Witnesses say they saw a stocky black man wearing a camouflage jacket take something from Jody's car, then drive away in a white BMW. But no one has ever been arrested. This case started off with a limited amount of information, limited leads that we were able to investigate, and we have exhausted those leads. Police have received tips in recent years, but hope these new billboards and a huge $100,000 reward will bring forth the tip that will bring Jody's family peace. I have so many incredible um, blessings in my life. I mean, I feel very grateful, um, but it's just this sadness that I carry with me all the time. And bring justice for Jody. I'm Devin Bartolotta for WJZ.